has nothing to do with giving God money. Can I say it again? Just for the CD purpose. <laughs> Tithing has nothing to do with giving God money. God doesn't need nothing from you. You couldn't even give God nothing. Everything on the earth already belongs to God. He don't need nothing from us. So when God sets something up, it's not because he needs it. Tithing and offerings is God's management training program for mankind. Boy, this is so important. God doesn't need a penny from us. And yet he tells us 10% of everything is mine. We only think of money. And that's our problem. If you get 10 pairs of shoes, one of them ain't yours. If you get 10 dresses, one of them ain't yours. If you bought 10 oranges, one of them is not yours. If you got 24 hours in a day, 2 hours and 40 minutes don't belong to you. I got no time to pray. What are you talking about? You got 2 and a half hours and 40 minutes that don't belong to you. You're a thief every day when you don't use those two hours and 40 minutes for God's purposes. Amen. You are a thief. A tired thief. <laughs> Sleeping on God's time. You spend two hours, four hours, eight hours watching cable television and don't give God his two hours and 40 minutes that belong to him. 10%. You can't even manage two hours and 40 minutes. You're trying to get money. You ain't money, money in your problem. Management is your problem. God could any time of day command you to give the dress away in your closet. One of them ain't yours. <laughs> so tithing and offering is not about money. It's about management. Can you consistently, God says, put aside 10% of everything for my purposes? That's tithing. Can you consistently? Now, now, now let, me, let me tell you something. Listen to me. 100% of everything belongs to God. What did I say? 100% of everything belongs to God. No, no. Say it again. What did I say? 100% of everything belongs to God. Okay. So, God blesses you with a paycheck of $1,000. How much of that belongs to God? Okay, you're doing good. You're the smart. Now, how much did God say to put aside for his work? 10%. How many is left? 90%. Which one does belong to God? Oh, you're getting smart. Okay. All right. So then why would God, if he owns all 1,000, want you to put aside 10% if all of it still belongs to him? Why? Because it's not about the money. It's about your ability to put it aside. Your will, your control, your discipline to put it aside. He's after your discipline. If you can manage the 10% properly, then he is happy to trust you with the 90%.